Y'all know that girl who posts a weekly OMAD vlog every week on Wednesday. She pretty consistent too. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another OMAD vlog. Today is Tuesday and I am sitting outside of Sam's. Y'all, Sam's got the best pizza in the world. Yes, I said it. This is my meal for the day, y'all. This is what I was craving. Two massive slices of pizza. And I will show you my desserts right here. These are the leftover cookies from last week's vlog, but yesterday. If you're following along, you know that I halved the serving. And so I ate the pizza and the milk, and it was a wonderful meal, y'all. Almost knocked me off my feet. <laughs> Today is Wednesday. And my job catered for radiology tech week. We had Olive Garden, so I got some meatballs, I got some pasta, bread. So that's two days. Take notes. Yesterday I ate bad. Then Wednesday came with the pasta. And then Thursday, I'm back on track with this lettuce wrapped cheeseburger absolutely delicious and i got some cookies i got some protein i got some sweet potatoes so yeah talk about balance why don't you yeah how this burger fire absolutely delicious um like it touched my soul i'm not even gonna lie it made me feel like i was eating a whopper or a five guys burger or just a professionally made burger like for real no lie i was so happy this day i got off work and actually did an hour of cardio and yeah that's it for the voiceover just wanted to introduce the vlog i'll let you guys listen to the music as i show you my other meals for the week Yeah. Happy Saturday. It is so cold. 40 degrees. Ooh. Ooh. I'm gonna have to put a coat on today, but um anyway, today is a new day. It's Saturday. We're heading to the gym. Yes. How y'all doing out there? If you've been enjoying the old man vlogs, have you subscribed to the um, at girls channel the girl that do OMAD videos y'all know that girl who posts a weekly OMAD vlog every week on Wednesday she pretty consistent too have y'all subscribed to her channel and you watching go hit the subscribe button what are you waiting for I am wearing this I'm wearing this top from TJ Maxx Pants are from Halara. Overtop is from Fashion Nova. Puma is on the feet. I need to go get some more. Y'all, these shoes are so comfortable. They, I feel like I'm walking on clouds, and I always feel like I'm walking on clouds. This is not just, I've had these shoes for probably four months. I think I'm gonna work out super light today. No, I'm not, what am I talking about? I think I'm gonna eat light. I'm between eating only fruit eating a salad with no meats and fruits and a smoothie, going vegetarian today because I've ate a burger every day this week and it wasn't a turkey burger, it was a real burger. Although I don't feel 
nothing. I know that I wanna give my body a break of eating something that's super easy to break down. Um, so yeah, that's something between all fruit, all fruit, a salad, no meat, and a smoothie. That's Chloe. Or a salad and some cucumber uh, with tuna fish on it and like do a real meal like tuna fish, fruit, whatever that. We're about to go to the gym. I'll show you guys what I'm eating. Hey, little girl. What you got in your mouth? Oh, that's the camera making it look like that. Say hey, <laughs> where you going? You gotta say hey to the vlog. You wanna say hey to the vlog? Come here. Pookie said no, I wanna go outside. Protein World sent over some Slender Blender. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just when I was running out. I think I'm out of protein. Yes. I have no more protein. So thank you. How many grams? 24 grams of protein. That's perfect. No added sugar. 206 calories. Someone asked me if I added protein to every meal. And I don't. But um, I try to. That's why I run out of it so fast. So I am very grateful for this. Now don't that look good. Can I make this? <laughs> okay. Y'all got the recipe on this bag. But yeah, so it um oh yeah, plenty of vitamins. Zero sugar. Oh yeah. It is cold. It's gloomy. This is the type of day you just want to stay in bed, okay? But I've been in the house. It's not even that I've been in the house. I've been asleep all day. <laughs> I just woke up. <laughs> Uh, it's about two o'clock. I got up at like one. They getting off work, doing an hour cardio has caught up to me today. I get up at 5 a.m. every morning to go to work. So, I be tired. By seven o'clock, I be ready to come home and get into bed. But I've been going to the gym, so. It caught up with me today, and I was like, you know what? It's Saturday, I'm gonna sleep in. Girl, I slept till one o'clock. Ask me how I feel. I feel so good. I feel refreshed. I feel like, yes. Whatever, Raquel, it can wait. Whatever, get your rest. That's how I feel. That's how I feel, I feel good. But now that I see it's 40 degrees, I don't wanna go to no gym. I'm gonna go though. <sighs> This is the kind of day you want to stay at home, make some chili, you know. Mm -hmm. Make some chili, watch a Hallmark movie or two. Watch one of them Tia and Tamara Christmas movies. Yes, that's what it's giving out here. But anyway, I'm going to go to the gym. Today I'm going to hit weights. More than likely I'm going to do like some upper body um it may turn into full body i don't know but yeah i'm out of celsius drinks and i am um gonna go to the store right quick get me one drink that because honestly like i said i don't really have the energy to be working out on this gloomy day i'm stalling I've been ordering so much stuff off Amazon, y'all. <laughs> Every day I'm like, hmm, what's on Amazon? This is my latest little purchase, these little additional bags. I'm gonna buy a little scarf and tie it around it. But yeah, I wore this yesterday to work. It was giving, fit everything in it, my lunch and everything. Now I'm taking it to the gym. Lord be with me, hopefully it's warm in there. But I do have on long sleeves, so that's good.
It's so hard to keep you close I was afraid to leave you on your own went to the grocery store i got this last week or last vlog when i was undecided on what i wanted to make my lettuce wrap burger with so i end up going with the other lettuce so i'm just going to chop this up and make a salad i got this jalapeno tuna creations i used to eat these packs oh my god so much y'all a while ago during my weight loss journey, they come in handy. They're 70 calories and 14 grams of protein. Um, so yeah, I said I wasn't gonna eat any meat today, but I feel like after the workout I had, I do need some meat, but I'm just going the tuna fish route and I'm gonna do it on top of this cucumber. I'll show you guys what it looked like. I got some grapes, I got some pineapple, I got my juice shots, and of course, more celsius because i was out so i'm just gonna get this salad chopped up we're having a very light eating day not really a fast but a fast from red meat and chicken and all of that put that little bit of um, tuna that was left that I ran out of cucumbers for in the salad, literally like a spoonful. I have two of the Immunity Boost shots. I'm gonna take both. I'm gonna take both of these. And I just put that like one tablespoon of whatever was le left in the pack of tuna. I got me a little fruit bowl. Got this recipe or this idea from Octavia B. Um, she is on YouTube and she did a what, in, uh, what do I eat in a day video and she had I think homemade tuna but I wasn't gonna do all that so <laughs> um, it looked pretty good so I decided to try it. This is the meal for the day. Very colorful and very um, you know vegetables and fruit pretty much. I'm gonna use that to dress my salad and I'm hungry. It's like almost 8 p.m. I'm eating late on purpose because of the meal. So I say, yeah, I'm gonna fast all day, fasted, workout, and I'm gonna end the night with my light meal. And I won't be hungry because it's gonna be time to go to sleep soon. So yeah, that was the thought process behind that. God is grace, God is good. Thank you for this food, Lord. Mmm. Let's see what it's giving. Mm. 
You know what? For my low carb girls out there, mm-hmm, give it a try. Thank you, Octavia girl. This is really good. I bet it's really good with real tuna, like homemade tuna. Like my god mama tuna. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This is really good. Great for a snack. Full of protein. Probably no carbs. The carbs probably coming from the um, cucumber, if that. Yeah. Well, guys, not much going on here. Just eating my fruits and veggies. It's not often that you see a completely healthy meal like this from me, but hey. It ain't out of the ordinary either. <laughs> I get a little healthy sometimes. Ha <laughs> cause tomorrow I gotta eat something real good. But like I said, the, I thought that burger meal was so fire. I don't know if it was the ketchup mayo, the burger, the red onion, the pickle, the cheese, the tomato, I don't know. That meal was absolutely delicious. I wasn't really feeling the sweet potato because I be needing my butter, cinnamon, brown sugar. I ain't have all that. So I end up, if y'all haven't noticed, I end up not really eating the sweet potatoes. But um, that was a good meal, but I know eating red meat every day. If it was a turkey burger, I would have felt better. But I wanted a real burger burger, so. Yeah, let's see what this salad giving. Mmm. It's that red onion. That red onion is setting everything off. Man. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow. I'm supposed to be going out tomorrow, so yeah. I'll let you guys know what I'm eating. Happy Saturday, it's 37 degrees in Memphis. It's freezing. rushing guys i'm at redlands about to have dinner starving i don't think i'm going to wear this coat inside i don't really want to look tacky like it's cold where's your coat but then again i don't want to be responsible for this coat I'm, wearing, I'm, I'm gonna put the coat back on. <sighs> I'll see y'all inside.
Had the best workout full body 45 minutes of cardio ran a little bit um i had a surprise gym partner my cousin showed up and surprised me so that like really gave me the boost to do that 45 minutes of cardio for one because i have a busy day so i was trying to you know i shaved out 15 minutes because <laughs> i've been doing an hour and then i was considering doing like 25 30 minutes but that ended up helping me get through and pushing through and jogging and all that good stuff had dinner last night had a great time um i ate pork chops mashed potatoes spinach dip and a chocolate espresso martini i have not had a chocolate espresso martini in pro since the beginning of my OMAD. Like, that was like what I really was drinking. And then I started back drinking wine. And then I like cut alcohol, kinda. So it felt really good to have that drink. And it was cold outside and it was chocolatey and it was good. I only had one, so. Um, but yeah, I'm getting on the scale tomorrow. I don't know. I don't know if I really want to or not. I don't really know. It's like I be having a mental note in my head of how I am eating. And it's like my eating this past week has been sort of a blur. I know I ate the burgers. One day I ate two. I don't know. But we're going to see. We're going to get on the scale tomorrow. I have not been on the scale in two weeks. So we're just going to see where I am. Um, this coming up week I have an event I'm going to on Saturday. So I'm really trying to look snatched. So... I'm going to have to lay off of the sweets. I'm going to try to this week. But yeah, y'all, this is Monday. And it's about 9.40 in the morning. I'm about to go get my hair done. So when y'all see me later, hopefully I have a nice little sewing, you know. And don't know what I'm eating today. But I'll be sure to let you guys know when I get it. What's up? We got some inches. 
We got a little sewing going on. I am starving. Went to Zaxby's. Went to Zaxby's. They was talking about wings and things while I was at the hair salon, y'all. And they put wings and things on my mind. So yeah, went to Zaxby's and got some wings and things. Ooh, I can't wait. Let me wash my hands. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Really, really exciting. 191 to 158. That sounds really good, right? I don't know. Let's get the measurements. 33. 26. That's the smallest that's ever been. 31. 39. This is me. 158 pounds. I'm excited. Yes, I am. <laughs> me from the side. Lost a couple inches, lost a pound. Where I am right now, subconsciously, I am trying to get to 155. It's no rush on it at all. I am actually like, really liking the way I'm looking these days, you know? It's like, what is three pounds, really? But. I still want to, you know, eventually hit that goal. Um, I'm going to have to meal prep this week. I love the cheeseburger. As, as a matter of fact, that cheeseburger is top on my meal prep list. Yeah, it was fire. The ketchup mayo, the onion, I'm telling you, that was really good. But next time, I will do it with a turkey burger. Last week, my job was um, honoring radiology techs, and I'm a radiology tech, and so that's why it was like the food was catered and <sighs> that day and whatever, whatever. But um, I feel better when I have like my chicken, my broccoli, my whatever it is, my sausage, my rice. Those weeks like that, I feel good versus I'm going to work, I don't really know what I'm gonna be eating today. No, I really don't like it. So today I am going to meal prep and that will be in next week's vlog. So I really need to come up with what I'm going to cook because it's going to have to be something simple because I really don't have time. <laughs> also, if you guys have any meal prep ideas, please leave me a comment. I am always open for meal preps or recipes that y'all know, you know, and you know, you know, keeps you full or just really tasty and delicious. Please leave me a comment. Like if it's a zucchini lasagna meal prep or just whatever you have tried and you know this is a really good meal prep that lasts in the refrigerator, you know, please leave me a comment. Um, that's really it, y'all. That's where I'm at. I'm so happy to be 158, to be low 160 when 160 has been my goal since 2014. And to be below it feels amazing. Not gonna lie, feels so, so good. I hope you guys are doing wonderful out there. I know that sometimes I may make it look like this diet is easy. It's not easy. It's the easiest diet I've run across because of the type of eater that I am, how I like to grub, how some days I don't really have an appetite too much. And then some days I wanna eat, I wanna go in. For me, this is a diet. Do I still struggle on this diet? Of course I do. I struggle, there's temptation all around me. Living in a home where you're the only person to eat one meal a day and you know, people bringing in all kinds of snacks and they're living their life and you having to be like, I can't eat that, you know, or I gotta wait until I eat my meal or I'll get it tomorrow. It takes effort, nothing is easy. So I feel you guys pain when y'all leave comments saying oh my god i, I want to try but this or i want to try but that 
I get it. That easy, it's worth it. It's not easy, it gets easier. It's not easy, there are some easy days. There are some easy weeks. There are some easy moments where you just like, wow, this diet is amazing. You know, it's with any diet or any lifestyle. You just have to want it and you have to give yourself time to see the results and benefits. And once you get results and benefits, that's what keeps you going. So hang in there, hang in there. And uh, you know, if you see OMAD is not working for you, try something else. It's not the only way to lose weight, you know? Or you know, you say, hey, I wanna do OMAD, but I wanna gradually get into it. Start eating two meals a day. Start eating fruit for breakfast, fruit for lunch, and then dinner, and then cut lunch. Fruit for breakfast, and then your one meal, and then cut that, you know? Like, just work with it. I just want to say that. It was just put on my heart to say that. But anyway, I'm not going to keep holding you guys. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to leave me those meal prep ideas. If you have any, shout out to you who told me to eat that cheeseburger. Girl, that cheeseburger wrapped up in lettuce. It was just fire. I still got some. No, I got no more lettuce. Okay, anyway. OBAD vlogs go up every Wednesday at 6 p.m. But just to be on the safe side, go ahead and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss a vlog from me. I love you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.